Hello Squadron, welcome back. For those who are new, my name is Omar, and of course, Happy New Year to all of you. This is my first video for 2024, and I thought it would be only appropriate for it to be a chakra cleanse and healing one. Absolutely, because we don't want to go into this new year carrying the energy of the previous year or years, all right? So all you have to do is, if you haven't already, uh, remove your shoes, remove any jewelry you may be wearing because jewelry is going to absorb the Reiki energy and we don't want that. We want it to all go to you, all right? Cut out your lights, set your devices to do not disturb because you really want to be in this experience, all right? So once you've done that and once you've gotten settled, then you are ready to receive the symbol. If you need more time, you can pause the video here and then come back when you're ready. But for those who are ready, all I want you to do is just sit back or you can lay down with your hands positioned so that your palms are raised to the heavens in a receiving position. We're going to focus on our four count breath. So I want you to breathe in. One, two, three, four. Hold. One, two, three, four. Release, one, two, three, four. Let us do one more round of that, breathing in. One, two, three, four. Hold, one, two, three, four. Release, one, two, three, four. Now that our breath is calm, our body is relaxed. I can send these Reiki symbols to you now. All you have to do is either set the intention or you can say a mantra over and over again. I accept the Reiki symbols that are being sent to me. That mantra again is, I accept the Reiki symbols that are being sent to me. Okay, here we go. Here's the first symbol. The second symbol. And the third and final symbol. And now I will set the intention I set the intention with these symbols to work with all that is watching this guided Reiki session for their highest and greatest good to heal and to cleanse and purge all of the chakras that we will be focusing on during this session. Let the benefits of this session be felt long after the session is completed and allow those to come back to this session as many times as they need to whenever they feel like they need to cleanse, purge, and heal their chakras. And so it is, we give thanks. Okay, with the intention now set, keep your eyes closed, hands continuing to have your palms raised to the heavens, And we are going to now bring the Reiki energy into ourselves. So the first chakra that we're going to be working with is a chakra that is all the way above you. This chakra can be seen as either a mini star or sun-like energy. It is referred to as the stellar gateway. And through this chakra, it connects us to source energy, the source of all unconditional love. We're going to bring that down. We're going to bring source energy in the form of Reiki down from the stellar gateway. So you can imagine this as a bright white light coming from your stellar gateway from that star-like chakra down to your soul star chakra. And your soul star chakra will be either a white 
for our aquamarine sphere or ball that is located 10 to 15 inches above the top of your head. So from your stellar gateway into your soul star, igniting it, bringing with it Reiki energy, unconditional love. Feel the energy cleansing and purging anything in your soul star chakra that may be halting it or causing it to underperform. Your soul star chakra connects you to the upper realms, to your angels, the ascended masters of time and space, your spirit guides, your spirit animals. It connects you to different energy beings, like I said, the different realms and different dimensions. So we absolutely want to make sure that this chakra is operating optimally. So as that per as that cleanse is now going on with the Reiki energy, let us now bring the light down even further into the top of our crown chakra located at the top of your head. The color of the crown chakra is usually violet. For some, it can be white. And again, feel it enter and rest in your crown chakra. The chakra that deals with enlightenment, our connection to, of course, everything outside of us. I like to see it as a spiritual receiver chakra. And now we're going to bring the energy down into our third eye chakra located in the center of our forehead, the color indigo, the chakra that deals with our psychic abilities and gifts, our intuition. I also see it as the decoder chakra for when we are getting downloads and intuitive hits and messages from our spirit team, from source, bringing the beam down even further now into your throat chakra located at the center of your throat, which is a light blue. This chakra governs your ability to express yourself fully clearly to share your truth with the world, to share your ideas. Coming down even further now to the center of your chest, to your heart chakra, green. The chakra that deals with unconditional love and it's also the chakra that is most closely associated with your soul, seeing as though our souls are the very embodiment of unconditional love themselves. Bringing this down even further now to your sacral, oh, to your solar plexus chakra, my bad, solar plexus chakra that is located roughly 10 to 12 inches. Well, no, sorry. Three to five inches above your belly button colored yellow. This deals with your inner strength, your confidence, also your gut instinct, your, your ability to really go after what it is you want in life. From there, we're now going to move down to the solar plexus which is three to five inches below your belly button. This chakra deals with sex, sexuality, imagination, creativity, because sexual energy can not only birth new life, but it can also birth new ideas. Whatever, create, whatever creative ideas 
come into existence through the sacral chakra, it is expressed into the 3D reality through the throat chakra. And from there, we now move down to the root chakra located at the base of the spine. Red. Oh. The solar plexus chakra is yellow and the sacral chakra is orange. I don't remember if I mentioned those colors. But now that we're at the base chakra, this chakra deals with our sense of stability, foundation, security, safety. It is also in charge of our fight, flight, freeze, and fawn responses. And from there, the energy will travel down, branching off so that it may travel down both of our legs, past your kneecaps, your ankles, through your feet, and then traveling through the soles of your feet, down into the earth, roughly 10 to 15 inches to where your earth star chakra is located. Now with this chakra, it can be a black, brown, or magenta color. And just like with the soul star chakra, it is also a sphere or a ball. This chakra is the super root for our entire energetic system. So if the root chakra grounds the seven chakras that are physically in our body, the earth star chakra grounds all of the chakras, whether they're inside or outside of our bodies and all of our different energetic bodies. And of course the aura itself. It also deals with our DNA origins, past lives, and karma, as well as the blueprint for the current life we are living. So with this chakra, we are now going to set a second attention that anything that is being cleansed or purged from our stellar gateway, our soul star chakra, our crown chakra, our third eye chakra, our throat chakra, our heart chakra, our solar plexus, solar plexus chakra, sacral chakra, root chakra, and earth star chakra. Let it be transmuted into positive energy to be released into the earth and whatever the earth star chakra cannot transmute into positive energy, let it thus be released to source or source of all God, goddess, creator, or even the earth itself, Gaia, to be transmuted by higher forces more powerful than ourselves. And this is our intention and so it is. We give thanks. And with this now, your Earth Star Chakra will be able to transmute everything that is being purged out. So going back up to your stellar gateway, we're going to bring even more Reiki energy down, even more unconditional love, more source energy down from the stellar gateway into the soul star, crown, third eye, throat, heart, solar plexus, solar plexus, sacral, root, earth star. And this process continues with wave after wave of energy surging through you, taking away what does not belong, any blockages, any stuck or stagnant energy, Anything that is caused by outdated programming, trauma that you went through, just feel it all being cleared and purged down to your earth star. But in its place, the energy that is coming 
from your stellar gateway is filling in the gaps or the places where all of the things that are being removed once reside. reside. There we go. <clears throat> so starting with your soul star, feel it being replenished, shining a bright white or aquamarine down to your crown which is now shining a bright violet to your third eye chakra that is shining a bright indigo your throat chakra which is shining a bright light blue your heart chakra which is shining a bright green your solar plexus chakra which is shining a bright yellow, your sacral chakra that is shining a bright orange, your root chakra which is shining a bright red, and your earth star chakra which is shining either a bright black, brown, or magenta, whichever color resonates with you for that chakra. And now we're just going to say one more part I release, I release, I release, I release. Say this along with me out loud or inside of your head. I release, I release. You can even do like sweeping uh, motions from over the top of your head all the way down past your feet. I release, I release, I release. And in the place of everything that we have released, let Reiki energy, unconditional love, and source energy take its place. And so it is. And so it is. And so it is. And we give thanks. Namaste. And with that, it is going to conclude this session. So I just want you to just let yourself move around, stretch, feel how much different, how much lighter you may feel now compared to when we started this session. Hmm. I know I feel better. All right, but that is going to do it for us. Let me know down in the comments how this session was able to benefit you. And as always, you can come back to it as many times as you need to. And I would love to hear your progress with it each time that you do. All right, down in the description, you will find my PayPal link. If you could donate, I would appreciate, but if you can't, I completely understand and you can do other things to help me like liking, sharing this video, and simply just subscribing. I'm currently on the Road to 100 Subscriber Challenge. Consider subscribing so that that way you can help me to reach that goal. And I have a wonderful live planned for my subscribers once I do reach 100, okay? And until we meet again, I am sending you Reiki energy on your journey to heal your shadow self and to embrace your true self. Namaste.